In part four of this tutorial on basic processing techniques of PicoSpin JCAMP data using the MNOVA NMR processing software, we're going to cover the subject of chemical shift referencing. So let's shift reference the spectrum. We access this function by clicking the reference icon on the processing toolbar or with the keystroke L. Once selected, move the cursor across the spectrum and the largest peaks will become highlighted in red as you pan the cursor across the spectrum window. If you want to select signals not picked up by automatic selection, then press the shift key once to toggle the fine control mode. Pressing shift the second time toggles back to the largest peak selection mode. To this sample of propyl acetate, I added TMS as a chemical shift reference, and so the rightmost signal in the spectrum is due to TMS and should be referenced to zero parts per million. Select the shift reference peak by clicking it, and a dialog box will appear. The new shift box displays the current chemical shift of the selected peak. By typing in a new value and clicking OK, the entire spectrum will shift according to the assigned value. Since the peak I selected is TMS and its chemical shift is defined as zero parts per million, I'll type zero and hit OK. If I didn't have TMS in my sample or used a different compound as a shift reference, I would then just select and assign a different signal in my spectrum as the reference peak. In most cases, we already have a good idea of the chemical shift of signals because the spectrum is known. If that's the case, then adding TMS is not required. In part 5, we'll appetize our data.